Hello everyone and welcome to a new lesson with Miss Rafa. Today we're going to start with Unit 4 Engineering. So let's start with the first skill that is reading. Let's get started. Sciences Engineering Let's start with a preview. As a class, discuss the following questions. How was life before the invention of engines? Why do you think the science of engineering has developed recently? Have you ever thought of being an engineer? Why or why not? What types of engineering do you know? Now let's start with the reading. Let's see some vocabulary first. Engineering Engineering Engineer Engineer Pulley Pulley Lever Lever we say lever in British and lever in American. Wheel, wheel. Engine, engine. Era, era. Millennium, Millennium, Architect, Architect, Architecture, Architecture, Consistent, Consistent. Principles, principles, water wheel, water wheel, water mill, water mill, windmill, windmill, wind pump. Wind pump, coal, coal, rapid, rapid, machine, machine, mechanical, mechanical. Axis, Axis, Cutting Gin, Cutting Gin, Executed, Executed, Maintenance, Maintenance, Mesopotamia. Mesopotamia Spinning wheel Spinning wheel Electronic engineering Electronic engineering Aeronautical engineering Aeronautical engineering 
Advent Advent Elevate Elevate Now let's start reading History of Engineering Throughout history, there have always been people who designed and built tools or other devices to solve problems or improve lives. The concept of engineering has been around since ancient times, as primitive engineers created basic inventions such as pulley, lever, and the wheel. Each of these inventions is consistent with the modern definition of engineering and makes use of basic mechanical principles to develop useful tools and objects. The Ancient Era Simple classic machines were known in the ancient Near East, and then the wheel and axes were invented in Mesopotamia during the 5th millennium BC. The oldest architect known by name Imhotep designed and executed the construction of the Pyramid of Tursa, a steep pyramid in the Saqqara region in Egypt around 2630 to 2611 BC, and he is also credited with first using columns in architecture. In Persia, the oldest practical water-powered machines appeared in the 4th century BC, the water wheel and the water mill. Middle Ages During the 6th century AD, the Indian engineers invented the cotton gin, and by the 9th century AD, they designed wind-powered machines such as the windmill and the wind pump. Later, the Arab engineers designed the spinning wheel in the early 11th century. This was essential to the growth of the cotton industry, which was the core of the early industrial revolution in the 18th century. European Renaissance The first steam engine was built in 1698 by the mechanical engineer Thomas Savory. The development of this device led to the emergence of the Industrial Revolution in the coming years, which allowed the beginning of the mass production of engines of various functions.
The Modern Era The inventions of the Scottish engineer James Watt gave rise to the modern mechanical engineering, which opened the door wide for the development of specialized machinery and their maintenance tools during the Industrial Revolution and led to the rapid growth of mechanical engineering in its native Britain and abroad. Chemical engineering, like mechanical engineering, developed in the 19th century during the Industrial Revolution. The work of James Maxwell and Heinrich Hertz in the late 19th century gave birth to the field of electronics and electronic engineering. Today, aeronautical engineering deals with aircraft design. This field of engineering has been growing day after day to allow humans make their dreams come true, to invade the outer space by designing better spaceships. Finally, with the advent of computer technology in the 1990s, the first search engine was built by the computer engineer Alan Emtage. The brilliant minds of engineers are still creating whatever it takes to elevate our world to make it a better place to live. Now let's answer some questions. Read the text and try to guess the meaning of the highlighted words. Then match them with their definitions below. Pulley Lever Millennium Gin Maintenance Aeronautical Elevate Let's see. A simple machine used to lift something heavy. Lever A machine that separates the seeds of a cotton plant from the cotton. Gin the science of designing, making, and flying planes. Aeronautical A piece of equipment consisting of a wheel over which a rope or chain is pulled to lift heavy things. Pulley Actions performed to keep a machine or system functioning or in service. Maintenance To raise something to a higher position. Elevate A period of 1000 years. Millennium Now B. Read the text again. Look at the list of people and the statements below. Match each statement with the person to whom it refers.
He developed the world's first internet search engine. Alan Imtage He helped to develop specialized machinery and their maintenance tools. James Watt His invention was the foundation stone of the Industrial Revolution. Thomas Savory The fields of electronics and electronic engineering emerged in the late 19th century. James Maxwell and Heinrich Hertz The pioneer of engineering who built a pyramid in Egypt. Emotive Now see, do the following statements agree with the information given in the text? Write true if the statement agrees with the information, false if the statement contradicts the information, or not a given if there is no information on this. Let's see. To develop useful tools and objects, all types of today engineering depend on all basic inventions such as lever and pulley. True. Emotive invented the first steam engine in the world. False. Thomas Savory invented the first steam engine in the world. Eli Whitney patented the cotton gin in 1793. Not given. The inventions of James Watt contributed to the growth of mechanical engineering. True. Aeronautical engineering is related to the design of electronic machines. False. Aeronautical engineering deals with aircraft design. Archie is a pre web internet search engine. Implemented by Alan Imtage. Not given. That's everything for today. Thank you very much. See you next lesson.